Since I was little, I've always wanted to be a cosmetologist and the school offered it. We were starting our dragsters, which are these like really cool steam powered cars. Once we're done, we're gonna like race them and see who can make the best one. It's honestly one of the most rewarding things I've ever done in my life. And I'm really glad I got the experience to be able to join electrical. It doesn't feel like a school setting at first. I chose to come to South Shore Tech because I wanted the opportunity to learn a vocational trade. I saw different opportunities for me to grasp. It wasn't just academics that I could come in and do um, lots of different career paths. It was very interesting to see all the different shops. It was really fun going into carpentry and using all the different tools and going into Cosmo and playing with the mannequins. It was all really fun. I wouldn't have even picked Metal Fab as one of the shops I wanted to explore, but going through it, it was like, I immediately knew that that's what I wanted. These teachers are like the most helpful people I've ever met. Their relationship with teachers is a lot more personal and it feels more like they're actually teaching you and giving you experience instead of just like throwing academic courses at you or giving you essays. Every other week, you get to do in shop, you get to work with different people that you wouldn't usually get to work with. You get to work with your hands a lot. My favorite thing to do in shop would probably be to do hair color because it's just fun and when I do it, it's creative, it's just like painting. I love CRT and collision repair and I love the painting and like, it's a mechanical based shop like most of the shops in the school, but there's still a lot of room for creativity in CRT. The actual designing on like InDesign and Illustrator and Adobe, like anything like that, I kind of like that the most. It's a very different learning atmosphere. When you come into a shop, it's more of like a family. Cosmetology services the public and it gives us an opportunity to walk into the real world where we take in clients, we answer the phones. Being a part of the Allied Health program is really fun because we get to do a lot of skills. We do CPR and first aid, self-defense for healthcare workers. Um, we're doing EKG. Being a girl in a non-traditionally girl shop seems really scary at first, but honestly, there's still other girls in it. And it honestly, it makes you feel proud of yourself because you're doing something you know not all the other girls know how to do. Co-op is, instead of going to shop, you go to work, you get paid, you still get school hours. I'm Joe Ercolini. I'm doing my co-op at Triangle Engineering, and I'm currently making the backings for the weld fixtures for the weld tests. We use the same techniques, same welding processes as uh, the shop in the school. What I want to do after I finish trade school is finish my apprenticeship, which lasts for three years after high school, take my test to become a journeysman, a licensed journeysman. I want to be a pastry chef and hopefully one day open up my own bakery. I, I want to go into the military probably, but after that I'd, I'd love to stay in the trade. Advice for kids coming into the school, I'd say it's really not as scary as it seems, or it's not as big or intimidating as it seems. Like, once you get settled into your shop, you're gonna get really comfortable. And if you're worried about like not having any kind of background or any kind of skills in a shop that you're interested in, you get to try it, you get to switch out if you don't like it. It's something that you can really, like you're there to learn and all your teachers and all your classmates understand that. I've met so many amazing people and they've made my life so much better. It's a once in a life opportunity that you'll get. And if you want a real world experience, real life experience, I'd come here. 